What is up with you wonderful, wonderful people? My name is Crazy, and I'm back with another W video. I hope life is treating you guys well. Hope you guys aren't out here being bots. Hope you guys aren't out here being finessed. And I hope you guys are doing everything I need to get done, done. Now that we got that out the way, let's hop into the video right away. Listen, Mike Tyson. You got to know who Mike Tyson is. There's no way in hell you don't know who Mike Tyson is, bro. Unless you're like some brand new doo-doo diaper baby that just popped up on the earth. I'm not believing you when you tell me you don't know who Mike Tyson is. I mean, guys, Mike Tyson, at, at one point... In time, Mike Tyson was considered the scariest guy on the earth. The earth. Do you know what the earth's population is or was back then, bro? It was over a billion. The, probably the earth's population is, is in the trillions. So you're telling me out of a trillion people, th that guy, th Mike Tyson, he was the scariest guy on the earth, bro. He got it. He, he got it. He got it, all right? The guy, the guy got face tattoos anyway. You should, not be, you should not be trying to test anyone that got a face tat, right? But listen, Mike Tyson... Over the past week, he got into a little controversy, bro. What was he doing? He was just chilling on the plane. He was on. He was on a public. He was on a public. A public plane. And he was being a nice guy. Cause guys, listen. Back in the day, Mike Tyson, he's like an asshole, bro. He said it himself. He used to be mean. He used to be bullying. He used to be aggressive. He used to be like that back then. But he's not that anymore. Mike Tyson's a completely different guy. He's way more calm. Way more respectful. Way more humble. He don't do the box no more. Instead, he smoke weed. He do LSD. He he's he's slurping the toad. Doing shrooms. He's doing everything but boxing. But it seems like the, the angry, aggressive side of Mike Tyson is still there. Right? Because last week he was on a plane, public plane. Some fan asked him for a picture. He took a picture of the fan. Usually, you know, I never I never met a celebrity before, but when you take a picture with a celebrity, that's usually it. You go on about your day or whatever you're doing. This fan did not leave Mike Tyson alone. He just kept bothering him, bothering, harassing him. And even allegedly, it came to the point this guy threw a, threw a water bottle at Mike Tyson. Yes, guys. Some random dude threw a water bottle at Mike Tyson. Because Mike Tyson just... And you know what's crazy? Mike Tyson acts like... He's like, chill. Stop. Can you stop? He threw the water bottle on him. Mike Tyson started beating this guy's ass. But I'm going to throw in the clip right now. <laughs> this is George talking to Mike Tyson, bro. This shit crazy, bro. Mike Tyson. <laughs> Hey Mike, Mike, come on. Let's go stop back. There's a horse, man. Jet blue, man, flight. Boy just got beat up by Mike Tyson. Turn that way. Yeah, he got f***ed up. Just trying to ask for an autograph, man. I don't know what happened. As you can see, Mike Tyson was beating the shit out that guy. I mean, he was literally. I mean, like I was literally watching that. Did you see his hits, bro? When he was, when I was watching him hit, I was like, damn, I was feeling bad for this guy. Like and sub, like and sub, like and sub. But then I did a little bit of research and I didn't feel bad for this guy anymore, right? Because this guy, his guy's, his guy's, this guy's name is Melvin George. Melvin George. Turned, and I, I, and you know me, guys, I got, I like to know about the stuff so much. I did even more research, guys. It turns out this guy is a criminal. He's a felon. He got out in 2020. This dude, this dude's a felon. He was, he was in jail for drug possession, criminal theft, and all, and all types of other stuff. This guy's a, so obviously he's not some random, but he is a bot. All right, he's the bot of the week. I might make that a new thing on the channel. The, 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 a bot, the bot of the week. This, Melvin George is the bot of the week for for even trying to stand the Mike Tyson, bro. What are you doing bothering Mike Tyson? This dude think is he a criminal because he been in jail? Because he got his butt fucked a few times? He think he can stand up to Mike Tyson? Nigga's crazy as hell. I don't get... After I realized... Honestly, I know I said I felt bad for this. I felt bad watching this guy get beat up. But in, in general, I don't feel bad for this guy at all. Like, what are you doing bothering... Mike Tyson, especially after the guy said chill. I mean, Mike, have you ever heard Mike Tyson choke, man? He got such a he got such a a calm, laid back voice. Like I I could not I couldn't if Mike didn't tell me to chill, I gotta chill, bro. Look, listen to his voice. On top of that, he beat he beat my ass if I didn't, right? This nigga thinks he a criminal, he could stand up to Mike Tyson, and guess what? He got slapped down. Guy's a bot. I mean, seriously, bro. This, I'm not gonna lie, bro. Whatever this Melvin dude was doing, he must have been doing it with some with some pretty ballsy people, bro, because the fact that you're not the fact that you can still intimidate Mike Tyson, I mean, the fact that you can still bother Mike Tyson just shows this nigga's a bot. And then to make it worse, Mike Tyson fucked him up. As you can see in the picture, as you can see in the picture, bro, this guy's face is all bloody up. He got his ass beat. He got fucked up. And I can't even blame Mike Tyson because the guy asked him to stop it on top of that. Mike, Mike Tyson took a picture with the guy. He didn't have to take a picture with the guy. I'm saying, man, these fucking fans, bro, you got, these, these people get so, these guys think that, 
as a fan, the celebrity owes you something. The celebrity don't owe you a damn thing, bro. You should be grateful the guy even took a picture of you. But I must say, I am curious, why the hell is Mike Tyson on a public plane, bro? He should be flying private. Look, Mike Mike Tyson is one of the few... I know, I was watching an interview with him, and he was talking about how he spent all his money because he was just partying, and he went completely broke. But the thing about Mike Tyson is, bro, this is Mike Tyson. All he has to do is do one fight, and he's straight. He's, he fight, he's financially set again. People will pay for it, bro. A few years back, he did a, he did a fight. Very successful. And who is beating Mike Tyson, bro? Put someone in his age range. Him put someone against someone in his age range. He's gonna win the fight. I mean, I don't know how many. I don't know how many people would take the fight because you know it's Mike Tyson. Me, I mean, listen. If they pay me good, bro, fuck, I'll take the fight. I'll, I mean, and when I say pay me good, bro, I need at least seven digits. I need at least seven digits. That's me lowballing. I need at least a mil, at least. You see what this? You see what that guy? You see what Mike Tyson did to this guy on the plane? Imagine him one-on-one -on -one with someone in the ring. I need at least a mil. I need life-changing money. I need beyond life-changing money to fight him. And I know, my, I know Mike Tyson didn't want to beat this guy's ass. I know he didn't want to do it off the rip because, like I said before, but Mike Tyson, he's a changed man, bro. If you listen to any of his podcasts or any of the interviews he's done, bro, he's a completely different person. He's, he's way more humble, way more nice, way more respectable. I guess he was always respectable because he's beating people's asses, but he was he, he's kinder is what I'm saying. He's, he's, a, he's a changed soul. But I can't even blame him for being that guy's ass because that guy was bothering him. Why are you bothering Mike Tyson, bro? The, 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 bro, I was, the guy, Mike Tyson just sitting on the plane chilling. Why are you bothering someone that's chilling? Because he's a celebrity? Bro, the, the guy already gave me his picture. What else you want him to suck your dick? Melvin George, bro, you're an L, bro. You're, congratulations, bro. You're the bot of the week. Clap it up. Clap it the fuck up for this guy. I'm not playing. This guy's a bot. Well, anyways, guys, I got an exam to go fail. Now I'm lying. I'll probably pass it. My name is Crazy. And I will see you guys again when I drop another. I, I don't know, guys, man. A lot, like a lot of entertaining stuff has happened this week. A lot of stuff to talk about. So who knows, bro? If I find the time, since it's, it's finals week and it's readers day, bro, y'all might get hit with another video. Who who knows? Y'all might. I'm already thinking about what I'm going to talk about next. So who knows, guys? We might. Be... Bro, can you guys see in the back? You guys see how that car slowed down behind me? Yo, what? Are they trying to get the drop on me? But anyways, guys, yeah, like I was saying, bro, I'm, there's a mad stuff that's been happening this week. So who knows? I might drop another video. I'm actually kind of thinking about what I'm going to do next. So who knows? You you might, you guys, nigga, when I drop this video, if it get two likes, I'm aiming the bar high. If it get two likes, man, I'll drop another video. My, my name is Crazy, and I will see you guys when I drop another W video.